This section tries to impress upon you the need to be alert and always concentrating while you are driving, not being distracted by anything such as mobile phones or loud music. Being alert means looking out for hazards, seeing road signs and markings, and acting on the information they give. Once again, safety is the overriding theme of the questions. For example, your mobile phone rings while you are traveling. You should A. Stop immediately B. Answer it immediately C. Pull up in a suitable place or D. Pull up at the nearest curb. The correct answer, which is the safest option to choose, is C. Pull up in a suitable place. Observation making sure you know what other road users are in your vicinity. Anticipation, thinking well in advance about what other road users may do next. Concentration, understanding the actions of other road users, staying alert and knowing what factors may affect your driving. Distraction, making sure you focus on your driving and avoid distractions. Common themes. Mobile phones. Several questions are likely to exist that concern mobile phone usage. The facts that you need to know are Never use a handheld mobile phone while driving. If you receive a call while driving, pull up and stop in a safe, convenient location before answering it. The reason you can't use a handheld mobile phone while driving is because it will cause you to lose concentration. Although you can use a hands-free mobile phone while driving, it is still likely to divert your attention from the road. Stay focused while driving. Have regular rest stops. Always take a break after driving for two hours. Plan your route before setting off. Avoid tiredness. Don't drive continuously for more than two hours. Keep fresh air circulating in the car. If you start to feel drowsy, find a safe place to stop and take a break. The facts you need to know. Blind spot is an area not covered by your vehicle's mirrors or an area blocked by the body of the car such as door pillars. Example question. What does the term blind spot mean for a driver? A. An area covered by your right hand mirror. B. An area not covered by your headlights. C. An area covered by your left hand mirror. Or D. An area not covered by your mirrors. The correct answer, of course, is D. Never overtake. On the brow of a hill, approaching a bend, approaching a dip in the road, approaching a left-hand junction with the road ahead narrows. Example question. In which of these situations should you avoid overtaking? A. Just after a bend. B. In a one-way street. C. On a 30 mile an hour road. D. Approaching a dip in the road. The correct answer? D. Approaching a dip in the road. Large vehicles. Keep well back when following a large vehicle as this helps the driver of the vehicle see you in their mirrors. Example question. When following a large vehicle, you should keep well back because this A. Allows you to corner more quickly. B. Helps the large vehicle to stop more easily. C. Allows the driver to see you in the mirrors. D. Helps you keep out of the wind. And the correct answer, of course, is C. Allows the driver to see you in the mirrors. Losing concentration, loud music, using a mobile phone, tuning the car radio, looking at a map and objects hanging from your interior mirror can all cause you to lose concentration and distract your attention. A-frames, also known as windscreen pillars, can obstruct your view of the road, especially when approaching a bend or a junction. Example question, windscreen pillars can obstruct your view. You should take particular care when A, driving on a motorway, B. Driving on a dual carriageway. C. Approaching a one-way street. D. Approaching bends or junctions. And the correct answer, of course, is D. Approaching bends or junctions. Headlights. Always turn your lights on at dusk, even if the street lights have yet to come on. You use lights so other road users can see you. Example question. You are driving at dusk. You should switch your lights on. A. Even when street lights are not lit. B. So others can see you. C. Only when others have done so. D. Only when street lights are lit. The correct answers? A. Even when street lights are not lit. And B. So others can see you. Alcohol and drugs. Both will affect your ability to drive. Don't drive when under their influence. Example question. You go to a social event and need to drive a short time afterwards. 
What precaution should you take? A. Drink plenty of coffee after drinking alcohol. B. Drink plenty of milk before drinking alcohol. C. Avoid drinking alcohol on an empty stomach. Or D. Avoid drinking alcohol completely. And of course the correct answer is D. Avoid drinking alcohol completely. Medicine. Don't drive if you have taken a medicine that has the potential to make you feel tired and groggy. If unsure, consult your doctor. Example question. During periods of illness, your ability to drive may be impaired. You must A. See your doctor each time before you drive. B. Only take smaller doses of any medicines. C. Be medically fit to drive. D. Not drive after taking certain medicines. E. Take all your medicines with you when you drive. The correct answers. C. Be medically fit to drive. D. Not drive after taking certain medicines. Reversing. If you can't see behind you when reversing, ask someone to guide you. Example question. You cannot see clearly behind you when reversing. What should you do? A. Open your window to look behind. B. Open the door and look behind. C. Look in the near side mirror. Or D. Ask someone to guide you. And of course the correct answer is D. Ask someone to guide you. The horn. Use your horn to be seen where you can't be seen such as at a hump bridge, where you may need to sound your horn to warn other road users of your presence. Example question. As you approach a hump bridge, you should A. Move into the middle of the road to get a better view. B. Slow down. C. Get over the bridge as quickly as possible. D. Consider using your horn. E. Find another route. F. Be aware of pedestrians. And of course, the correct answers are B. Slow down. D. Consider using your horn and F. Be aware of pedestrians. Obstructions. Objects hanging from your interior mirror may restrict your view. Example question. Objects hanging from your interior mirror may A. Restrict your view B. Improve your driving C. Distract your attention D. Help your concentration The correct answers A. Restrict your view and C. Distract your attention 